another story. So we are having our special guest of honor in our midst and we we'll allow him to introduce himself now. Can we know your name and okay first of all we want to thank the Basilica Media, the Grace Media for having me. I'm precious Ukiri by name. Okay. Um which department are you a graduate or Okay, uh, I graduated from the Department of Architecture. Oh, but I'm currently doing my master's program here. Wow, so you're an architecture. So finally, you will be the one to draw a church. <laughs> okay, okay, no problem. We are hoping that you are currently running your master's. Yes. Okay, no problem. Okay, going to our main aim for this, which is um, my Basilica story. Can you tell us how do you get to find this place? Was it referred by someone or you are just passing, you know? That kind of a thing. Okay, uh, it's a long story, but I, I did pre-science around 2017. 2018, when we moved to the main campus, you know, some Anglican in pre-science. Okay. We were looking for Anglican churches, and you know, we have the main one on campus for students, which yeah. is Chapel of Redemption. I went there, but I was not comfortable because the, the crowd was too much. Okay. Yes. So, so I needed was, a small place. And, yes, I needed a place it. where I would be I'll be in the church, I'll flow with what is happening on the church. Okay. Uh, with the church. And a friend of mine, it was a lady that actually referred oh, me to that this. Is a lady. <laughs> was a okay. that referred me to this place and I came, I enjoyed the service twenty eighteen. Oh, and ever okay. since then I think I've been a member of the oh, okay. place. Um, who, um, which reverend or pastor was there then? Okay. Can you remember the name or something? Yeah, that was that is Pastor Felix. Oh, Pastor Felix. Yeah, now a reverend. <laughs> okay, now a reverend. Okay, no problem. Um, since you joined the Basilica of Grace family, have you joined any units or something, or were you before? And okay, the thing is that architecture is a jealous lover. Yeah, it do not give you time to, <laughs> to not give you time to participate in some of that things. So I've not actually been in any department though in 2019 i think i met the pastor that was here pastor Felix. that okay. i want to start up the media department oh <laughs> that is he, interesting <laughs> he, he kicked against it only because the, the church building was not yet finished okay. as it is now so you don't want it that the, it was not presentable enough okay. so our okay. camera at that time was taken to uh, St. Michael's and all angels okay. that's why I wow. relaxed so you actually had that vision before? Oh, I had okay. a vision and I met the priest so now you are your masters do you think that it will still give you the advantage to still push them with their team? the thing is that if I'm giving the opportunity I like what the media team is doing Okay, uh, as a credit to them. Yes, they are actually doing a very great job. I, I follow them on Facebook and some other platforms okay. and they are doing very well. Uh, okay. If I will have my way, I don't think I will have the luxury of time to participate fully on it, but I will always encourage them maybe. Okay, give them your encouragement yes. and all that. Okay, no problem since we have gotten that. I We actually testify that architecture I can still remember when we had our act two hour. I slept there for three days. So, okay. <laughs> so it's not something that I don't know about. Okay, but all the same, no problem. Can you tell us what interests you most in this church, Basilica of Grace? The uh, Basilica of Grace is a wonderful church. And something that keeps me in church, apart from the music and the rest of it, mm. is the word of God. Okay, the word of God. That's yeah. apart from the music aspect. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the music aspect is a driving force. Yes, they are part oh, of okay. everything that make it all. But okay. what keeps me basically in the church is the word of God. And okay. the word of God has been constant and evolving in this church. So, okay. so it really is getting me and it's keeping me. So, from our records, we have that since when you started being a member of Basilica, it was Pastor Felix. Then to Reverend Christ who is announced to our Reverend Chukudima Chukuma. Okay, can you tell us just a brief experience with Pastor Felix, Reverend Christ Wise, and this current Reverend? Just a brief 
experience you have with them, man. Okay, this question is quite tricky. <laughs> <because> <laughs> I'm trying try to share. compare. <laughs> not I'm like not comparing, that. just your experience. Okay, Tell us your experience, your experience and your experience. Okay. The thing is that I told you that this thing is evolving. It's evolving okay. nowadays. Uh, during the time of Pastor Felix, I really, that was when the church started. Yeah. I think that was the first year, our second year, I became a member okay. here. And it, I participated, that was when I had some time because I was my first year yeah. to come for weekly service. I personally, I had a miracle testimony. Oh, wow. Yes. <laughs> okay. And if I have the time, I will share it. Okay. If you give me the time. No problem. Yeah. We'll get to that. Okay. okay. Um, it was okay. The church was growing. And okay. time of uh, uh, Reverend Christ wise, you know, everybody may not have the same pattern. Okay. The same Reverend Christ, Christ wise, the way I see it is that he he brought in a lot of people into his administration. Yeah. He brought in a lot of yes. People. He really tried and yes. that's great. Like you see people involvement more. Yeah, you understand okay. Uh, though Pastor Felix, I enjoyed his own pattern of, uh, okay. of organization of, yeah. of service. I, I enjoyed it so much. But Reverend Christ, wise, his own was bringing everybody along into the into it, just uh, like level parts. Yeah. <laughs> it's our turn. If you okay, that. you know that so, kind of thing, yeah. bringing everybody into the system and yeah. not like um, you know handling. Yeah. Okay. Okay, because I believe that it's not actually everybody that can follow up everybody. Not everybody can work with Pastor Felix, not everybody yeah, can work with Reverend yeah. Christ. Yeah. So, coming down to our current yeah. priest, what do you have to say about Okay, our current priest is still new here. Yeah, we will oh, try to talk mm, a bit fresh as. <laughs> but what, okay. I'm say, what I will have to say is that um, uh, I love his charisma. Wow! Wow! Yeah. <laughs> I love his charisma. I okay. Just like. I can also compare it to that of uh, Pastor Felix. Oh wow, you yeah. too have charisma. Okay. Yeah, I have charisma. I love That's charisma. a beautiful one. His, his sense of presentation. Even wow. when, as a priest, you know the way he put on his priestly attire. Oh my, so I've been admiring his clothes. Yeah. <laughs> he does yeah. join the priesthood because of <laughs> yeah, <laughs> his clothes. Because he needs to be a priest when you see him wow. appear before. But the truth he is that he's there. always nicely, neatly, perfectly dressed. Yeah. <laughs> he actually know what he's doing. When yeah. Do you think we should accord that 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 thing to the wife or to him? Uh, who do you think we should? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not leave with them. Okay, you get to that level. Okay, no problem. So let's keep it that way. We love each three very much, and the fact they are all good. Yeah. So, so can you tell us your general? What do you feel? What do you? Feel like when somebody asks you where are you going to church, be like Basilica of Grace. Okay, can you tell me more about Basilica of Grace? Let me say I'm the person. Can you tell me more about this church? Okay, Basilica of Grace Church, as it's if you were here the first year, as I said before, the first year, the second yeah. year, you will see that the, the notion <coughs> about this church is not completely denominational. Okay, yes, okay. any person can come in from any denomination and flow okay. with you. Okay, I've heard that from somebody yes, before. With the mood. I, yeah. I, several of my friends have followed me to this place and they can attest to that fact. Okay. Most of my friends, they became members, even my roommate became members, mm. even when they don't have wow. Anglican background. Okay. You are really an evangelist. So how many persons are the in <laughs> church? <laughs> no, they are much. They are okay, much. they are much. Well, well, most of the after first day, they go to uh, maybe College of Health Science, okay. what is okay. No problem, that's very congratulatory of you. You have really been a very nice and good member, quality one. Okay, okay. okay. can you tell us? Um, and this is shout out to the officials, shout out to the workers of the church, even the priests. Can you highlight to us where and where we need to touch so that things will keep on running to the perfect place? Okay, on this question, I will really try my best. But okay, no you know, not everything in this part of uh, the discussion can be disclosed with the camera. Oh, no problem. Mm -hmm. Because no problem. it's like pointing out one or two things. Yeah. But so far, they have they have tried. Okay. They have tried. They have tried to improve. Uh, 
But what I will also say is that you know this is a church that is made of students. Students come okay, and they go, and go. Uh, uh, just okay. like soldiers. So what I will say is that in the aspect of choir, you have seen that very good very good people that they know what they are doing in place of music, they okay. come and they graduate, and they, they graduate. graduate. And so they I will encourage them that before going, take time to okay. train some yeah, other to hand over the man to okay. yeah, so train them, not just hand handling over. Train okay. them, train them well. some of them so that yeah. they will follow that pattern that okay. have started. It will not look like okay, some uh, 2020 will be better than 20. Mm, yeah, you're supposed but to keep on moving higher yes. and higher yes. and higher. But they okay. are trying so far, the priests okay. uh, we commend their efforts. Um, uh, do there's always a room for improvement. Yeah, there is always room for improvement. Yes. Okay, no problem. Um, we have heard your own version of the story. Try to recruit, train them, and you know those kind of things that are very good for church growth and all those things. Yes. But well, congratulations once again for your time. Thank you once again for everything. I know it's not an easy thing just to you know call you for an interview and be throwing you questions like this and you just be answering them and dodging some <laughs> you know that kind of a thing okay. well no problem um we have heard what you said and it was nice speaking with you okay. so during that period you actually wanted to start the media thing what do you actually have in mind that you know what was your purpose what was your moving force in it okay you know something is that uh, the 21st century church is not just a local church, it's a yeah. global church. Yeah. So you can be in a small place and go wide with, yes. with the message. Yeah. So, and what, what is it? Is it the, the media and the, so, with, and the social media? Okay. You see, so that was my driving force. Uh, some years ago, though, with time I've forgotten, I had the knowledge of this media yeah, and all of these things, yeah. projection and all these things. but. I've left them for a while now. So that was, I said, okay, let me take this thing and make it global. Okay. Um, it make, you can sit here with your Facebook, we are connected to thousands of uh, people. Mm -hmm. And something that also drive me was because, you know, I told you architecture is a jealous lover. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. I, uh, I am the type that is always active in church, okay. but in Basilica, truthfully speaking, I'm not active. Most of our members don't even know this face. Yeah, and, and that's why you have over so that we show that face to them. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm here for over six years, uh, okay. a consistent member, but most yeah. of our members don't know this face. So no I was, I'm always active in church and I wanted to like do something yeah, in church. Do more. Yeah. But as it did not work, uh, okay. and my department didn't allow me. Okay, no problem. Um, no problem. I would still love to go into that architecture. I love those that are jealous <laughs> that they have me. Okay, so what would you tell those that are trying to enter the church, those that are trying to leave the church, and those that will be seeing this that are not even part of the church? So what advice are you giving out to them? So, you know? Okay, I will start with those that want to leave the church for one or two reasons. Okay. Uh, you can't leave the church. That is, I'm, I'm not trying to force you to be a member of the church. Okay. But the reason, maybe one of the reasons why you want to leave the church is because they are not doing it your own way. Okay. But a church should not be drawn the way you want it. it should be drawn the, the, you know, on the standard that has been set. Okay. So just kill your ego, bring down yourself, okay. and flow with it. You will enjoy it. You will not see the reason to leave again. Okay. Uh, and those that want to join the church, I will say Basilica of the great, <laughs> great church. Yeah, the great church. I can testify to you. Yes, I have been here with several miracles, and uh, you don't have, you just have to be part of this family. It's a great family, and uh, I will encourage you to be part of what is happening here. Okay, no problem. So, shout out to all of you there. Um, okay. This is um, Precious yeah. Ukiri. So, we thank you so very much. He's part of us. He's part of the Basilica of Grace member. And trust me, wherever I am in the church, I'm always citing him. <laughs> he's one of the people you should meet. Well, he's an architecture, so you have if you have any architectural work, just okay, contact him. Well, this is Basilica of Grace, the media team. 
um, and also in conjunction with the Brilliant Gospel Sounds. We thank you for being here with us. We thank you for your time and others. And everything you have noted will actually, in one way or the other, reach out to the people you are sending this information to. Thank you for acknowledging us. Thank you so very much. So for you out there, watch out for our next season, okay? So thank you very much.